2160 Killington Court in McDonough. Looks like a, a newer, uh, actually it looks like a brand new architectural roof. This is a four side uh, brick home. I'll take a walk around so you can kind of see. It's very overgrown along the sides. Need a lot of uh, trimming to be done on these bushes. This tree would need to be trimmed back and then I would definitely put a privacy fence around it. See, here's the side of the house. I'd definitely put a privacy fence around it because we're right here on the corner, but this is the backyard. Now, as we come to the back of the house, there's a window there that needs to be replaced that goes into the master bath. You can see you got this screened and closed porch back here. A lot of the screens need to be replaced. Then now as we get to the side of the house, this is the other side of the house. Now let's come on in. And there's this crack right above the garage. It looks like it's just from uh, from when they put up that basketball hoop because it goes right underneath there. So I don't think there's any foundation issues. Now as we come in, this is a three bedroom, two bath. Definitely needs paint. Walls need to be patched up. And when you come into the kitchen, kitchen's pretty much hammered. Uh, this needs to be gutted, I would say. Missing, uh, missing cabinets there. A lot of these uh, cabinets are broken. Big crack in the, the countertop. Needs all new appliances. And we got this nice hole right here in the ceiling. Not sure what that is from. As you come around, got a laundry room. And people are putting fans in weird places nowadays. Here's a fan in the laundry room. Then we got our garage. I think we, some of those windows are broken up there, so not sure if we can just fix those or if the door would need to be replaced. Water heater's been all disconnected. Some of the copper was cut off. Now as we come around, here's the door that leads out to that back porch. They have it nailed shut so I can't go out on that. Then that takes us to the dining room. I mean, as you can see, all the flooring's gonna need to be replaced. Then in the living room, nice high ceilings, ugly fan. Now, as we pass the living room, that's gonna take us to the bedrooms. But now this bedroom has wood floors. They're really scratched up in a lot of areas. So I'm not sure, they don't look like they're real wood, if that's something that could be fixed. Then we're missing a windows broken right up here in the front. Now in the bathrooms, I'm not sure if you'd want to change those out, but it has those ugly small tiles then I'd say a new vanity then there's some kind of discoloration right here uh, the ceiling going in a straight line 
that goes in towards the master bedroom. But now in the master bath, again, we have the ugly small tiles. Vanity jacuzzi tub. Here's that window that was broken out. Then the separate stand-up shower.